Hi guys, it's Kathleen. So I'm back with another nail video and I'm going to use this orally color. It is called Ingenu or Ingenu, I don't know how you pronounce it. And I'm going to drop a little bit on my foil and then with a dotting tool, I'm going to line my French diagonal. And why I like using the same color nail polish is because I feel like it ties everything together and it just makes everything look so much better. So once I have that, I'm going to take two acrylic paints, a light purple and a dark purple. One is like a lilac and the other is like a plum color. And I'm going to draw flowers and the petals are going to be drawn with the lilac color because I want the light flower, you know, outside and then I want the plum color in the middle. So once my petals are semi-dry, I'm going to go in with the plum color and I'm going to smear in the plum color into the light color and it just gives the flower more detail, more depth. You can do it the opposite. You can do a dark color on the outside and then do a light color on the inside, whatever your heart's desire. And then I'm going to take green acrylic paint and I'm going to draw my stems or leaves whatever you want and again it's just to give the flower more detail finally I'm going to take some yellow dots and I'm going to add them in the center of the flower let's go again to give it more detail and with a flower you can use any colors you want combination of of different colors just to make the flower look better and for my other nails I'm going to take black acrylic paint that I have thinned out very thinly because I want my zebra stripes to be nice and flowy. My thing with the zebra stripes is you just have to let your brush go wherever it goes. You just put it on your nail and then you have to stick to like a Y shape and when you do the Y shape and you just let your brush flow you get these nice zebra stripes and it just looks they just look so good. And then I'm going to take the lilac color and I'm going to highlight some of the zebra stripes. And this, I, I was a little like iffy on if I should do this, but when I did it, oh my gosh, it literally tied the entire nail design together. It just brought everything together. I was afraid that the zebra stripes were going to like throw off the flowers. I don't know why. But when I added in the lilac, oh my gosh, I fell in love with this nail design. <laughs> So once I have cleaned up my nails and added my top coat, this is what my nails look like. I want you guys to always remember that when you're doing a nail design, it can be whatever you want, but as long as your colors match or they go together, the nail design just comes out so good. So always be, you know, willing to try different things and just stick with the colors that you like and your nails will look fabulous. I hope that you guys enjoyed this video and that you please subscribe and share with others and I'll catch you guys in my next video. Bye guys!